Hey, what's going on guys? Um, so the new DLC is now out, Finance and Felony in GTA Online, and we're going to be taking a look at some of the new cars. Now, the first one that we're looking at is the Windsor Drop, and this is it. You can see it here with the red roof. It looks really, really cool. Uh, the standard Windsor's just behind it. You can see there's the only real difference is obviously the roof. Uh, this one looks a little bit longer as well. It's got a bit of a bigger boot. Where on that one, the boot's a bit small, you can see where the roof goes over to it. And the window's a bit different on the back as well. So what I think we need to do is take it for a test drive and see what they like. This is the standard one, like I say. I think they've both got the same interior, which we're going to take a quick look at. Yeah, um, the hood on it, again, pretty much the same. It's got the nice little badge on the front. They've not changed it. But let's see what this one's like inside. Let's take it for a drive. Well, actually, first we'll check the interior. The inside of it, yes, yeah, still pretty clean, still nice, same as the other one. The fact that it's got the roof is nice, you can put the roof down. Looks pretty good. Let's take it for a spin. Speed wise, um, I'm going to do a separate test for that where we'll test it out properly on a track, see which has got the best speed. But let's take it just for a spin around, just see how it handles and stuff. So straight away, it feels nice. Um, it feels quite light as well, which is quite surprising because of the size of the car. The braking's not too bad on it either. Going down the street in it, to be fair, I think it looks better with the roof up. So I'm going to put the roof up now. I like it at the back where the wood slides out. It's a little bit different than the other ones. Uh, the roof, I presume you're gonna be able to change the color. Uh, when it's in red, it looks all right. I think it'll look better than maybe a white soft top or something. But driving around in it, it looks pretty good. It feels pretty good. The price of it, it is quite pricey. Definitely take a look at it. Uh, whether it's worth buying, to be fair, if you're going to use it in races or something, I'd say no. If you're going to use it just to show off and mess around, then it might be alright. Um, to be fair though, I prefer some of the other soft tops, convertibles. But considering it's new, I will probably pick it up, see how it customises, see what we can do with it. But let me know what you guys think. This is the new Windsor Drop. Like I say, it looks alright, looks pretty cool. I am going to do a full speed test. If you guys want to check it out and see what it's like on the track and see how it compares to the other ones speed wise, definitely make sure you subscribe guys and check out the other videos. But that, that's it for this one. This is the Windsor Drop. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please hit the like. Don't forget to subscribe as well. But thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.